Hello there, YouTube. I'm scrapping out this motor, so it doesn't matter to me how bad it is. Trust me, the head's warped, the head gasket's burned out. Well, as I was taking it apart, I thought, well, this rod looks kind of new to me. Well, I know these nuts ain't tight, but look at all that play. See that? See that? I know the nuts ain't tight. <clears throat> okay. I know it won't show up on camera, and I'll take some pictures, but... The oil, uh, the oil hole is not even chamfered, and it looks like it was homemade drilled. See where it's drilled in here? Let me get it on camera. See where that hole's drilled? There's another little one down in here. Okay. Now, there's not a whole lot of destruction wear on there, or actually on the crank, which I'll take some pictures. But I could feel a lot of rod play in this motor. I figured, well, it's junk. Well, I know these governors rattle on these type of motors. I know the cam gears do, the custom motors, I just know they do. The one I took off my garden tractor was running until the magneto died. Can't find one, I searched all over the internet, gave up, get back on the film. But I could feel all that rod play. I'll take some pictures of it. I don't think this thing run that long after it was put together. I think this rod had been replaced, possibly the piston. I'll take some close-up pictures. That's a lot of play. I mean, that's a lot of play. I can stick it back on there, but I'll take some pictures of it. That is a lot of play. You can only put the cap on one way or it won't line up. It only goes on one way. I didn't mark it because I didn't care, but it's a pretty cheesy way of drilling an oil hole. Just thought I'd make this and post it in case somebody runs into this. That should be chamfered. That means the ra edges are radius. You shouldn't reach in there with your finger and feel a sharp edge of metal. It's just going to wear. And put metal on it. Metal the aluminum onto the metal crankshaft. Not to make this too long, we're out of here. We'll leave you some pictures. I'm not handling this thing with bare hands. What a grunge mess. Thanks for watching.